That's me, Emerson Stone. You know, I found Pete's. I found the heart when I needed them the most. That is until I came up with this reminder. Remind yourself at phonekeyscom.com. New Airhead Bites got tasty bite-sized pieces. It's up to you when you share them. I've been doing right, I've been doing wrong. Champagne in my glass, and I'm so gone. I done seen it all. All right, okay, so I guess this is real talk, real quick. Real talk, real quick. That's funny. Um, this is actually about like people who drink and drive. I don't know. I have a pretty good amount of experience with this. Uh, it's weird. Uh, you know, I think you're an asshole. If you drink and you drive, you're an asshole. I don't care how you justify it. You're an asshole. You don't give a shit about yourself. You give a shit about the people who give a shit about you. Because nine times out of ten, a person that's willing to drink and drive, it's probably a person that's willing to <sighs> take his frustrations out on his family or her family, whatever. So, yeah, you are an arrogant piece of shit. What you do? Secondly, you don't give a shit about the people on the road, which, which, which somehow to me makes me think that you believe that you're somehow better than somebody else, because what you want or what you're going through is more important than you know this person getting home, because you put other people in danger when you fucking drink and drive. So, oh, it would be horrible if I were the mayor of any any city, town province, corner, corner in the room, I don't give a shit, man, I would, the, I would throw the book at, you, at these people so hard, like, as soon as, as soon as I caught you drinking and driving, I'm taking your license away forever, they could never get it back, you get caught one time drinking and driving, license gone, if you want to drink, fine, drink, and another thing about drinking and driving, the people, like bars, bars should be held accountable, I think. All they want is to get, you know, because you, you realize the things that you're doing to people's family, especially when you deal with somebody who can't stop drinking. Yeah, I get the fact that it's all about turning a profit. But at the end of the day, if they get drunk and you let them leave, you should be held accountable. Same thing for people who are just like going over someone's house and gets drunk. You should be held accountable because you did nothing, assholes. Anyways, as you can tell, no uh, frustration, no whatever. I don't drink. So, oh, and in the words of my grandmother, I don't dip, drink, smoke, nor chew. So, yeah. Anyhow. Look what life did to ya Pop another bottle I really need to pray